Hello and welcome back to Volatility 411. I'm Kevin Davitt, part of SIBO's Options Institute, and it's Monday, March 21st. The S&P 500 index is coming off its best weekly performance since just after the elections in 2020. The large cap index jumped 6.2% and implied volatility levels came in considerably. The VIX index moved from nearly 34 last Tuesday to finish the week below 24. In the process, the VIX futures ended their longest stretch in backwardation since the early portion of the pandemic. This morning, the VIX index is measuring about 24 and a half, and the April VIX future is trading 45 cent cents below the May contract. The front month standard VIX contract is trading around 25 and a half, and the 25 strike straddle is worth about 580. So, based on current VIX option implied volatility levels, the market expects a April VIX futures range of 3080 to 2420, looking out to April 20th. Now, it's worth noting that the Q1 earnings will kick off the week of April 12th. For example, a variety of big banks will likely report between the 12th and the 15th. Fed Chair Powell will speak later this morning following last week's rate hike. The Fed Fund futures are now pricing in six more quarter point hikes before the end of this calendar year. So, Forward volatility measures have declined, but U.S. and global equity markets are likely to remain sensitive to headlines out of the Ukraine. That's Volatility 411 for Monday. Thank you very much for tuning in.